All right, guys, today is the day. I'm here in Bentonville, Arkansas, which is a funny story because I actually grew up in Arkansas, just not this part of Arkansas. I grew up in Pine Bluff, Arkansas, which is another world compared to Bentonville. Who would have ever thought I would be coming to my home state to mountain bike? This is cool. I couldn't imagine any other reason to come back to Arkansas, but what other reason? than to come mountain bike and bring the remedy and bring you guys along too. So I'm super excited about that. But we're gonna go meet up with Jared from Cure Cycling. He gonna show me around. We're gonna start at Kohler and go from there. And I hope you guys enjoy the video. Thunderdome. Oh, hey. I need more speed. Thunderdome right here. I didn't know that was there. I didn't know what I was getting into. Hey, nah, getting in. I hit the brake. How's that for a warm up? This is unbelievable. Look, the trails are just perfect. Yeah. All right, guys, so far, this is sick. I'm out here with Jared from Cure Cycling slash Bikes Online. So you climb on concrete out here? Yeah. This is crazy. It wasn't always like this. This is a couple years old now. We gotta move to Vanderbilt. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you think? That's pretty good? Oh yeah. Yeah, so that first bit, that's like the easier stuff. Uh huh. The next third is like medium. And then the bottom, like the last four jumps, pretty big. <gasps> oh, do they have tables? Yeah, they're all tables. Okay. Riding these Bentonville trails is on a whole nother level. They are just perfectly curated for riders. And you don't have any choice but to become a better rider if you ride these trails over and over. And luckily I was able to ride with somebody familiar with the trails, Jared from Cure Cycling, because he really was able to give me some knowledge and some tips on how to become a better rider and skills that I didn't have that I needed to know in order to do the things that I wanted to do on this trail. Now the warm-up line on Thunderdome, it felt good, especially on the Remedy. The Remedy is pretty much made for these trails, in my opinion. It's perfectly suited for the type of riding you do out here. But I felt good on Thunderdome, but not 100%. I was still a little timid and a little hesitant on some of the jumps and doubles and turns. And the berms are always a hard thing to learn. Dang, I gotta get, I gotta get better in these corners.
Those are some big jumps at the end. Yeah, it's too big. Dude, I gotta get better in those corners, man. It's taking, it's taking a lot of my speed. I'm too nervous about washing out. Would do you well to lean over the bars a little more, uh -huh. which is a scary thought, but that's how you get grip in that front tire. I had to work on that for a really long time. Man, it just sucks up so much of my speed when I gotta hit the yeah. brakes so much. Yeah, and and the truth is, is it is those berms are designed for like minimal braking. Like mm -hmm. you need the speed coming out to to clear a lot of the features. Now we decided to hit fire line again because I was determined to clear these jumps. He said he had never cleared the last jump. And I said, man, I, I can clear that jump so I know you can. I've never done it, but I know I can after the tips you just gave me and the confidence this Trek Remedy gives me. I can clear these jumps. So huge shout out to Jared because he really stepped up my confidence. And these trails are so awesome. They just shoot you up exactly where you need to be on the jumps. and land you exactly where you need to land so you just pretty much gotta be confident and just do it Thank you, Remedy. It's the best. Love it. I have my all my faith in you and you <laughs> you came through. Oh, oh, that was crazy. That's perfect. All right. So after all that, within a matter of about an hour or less than an hour, I became a totally different rider just because of these trails and how good they are maintained and the tips Jared gave me, this is awesome. I can't wait to show you guys the rest of the trails I rode because this place, it, it lived up to the hype for sure. It's definitely not what I'm used to as far as, I guess, traditional mountain biking where you go out and climb up and go down or cross country or just mountain biking in the mountains in general. This is just a huge bike park pretty much with all kinds of riding that you can think of so this is awesome benville lived up to the hype and i'm really excited to show you guys the rest of these trails so make sure you stay tuned for that <laughs> <laughs> 